This video demonstrates how to assemble Innovation Cabinetry's wall and angle cabinet. Before you begin, ensure you have all the cabinet pieces shown here. First, place the door on your workstation with the hinge holes closest to you. Attach the adhesive door stops to the top outer corners of the door on the side opposite the hinge holes. Next, align the hinges with the pre-drilled holes and use a drill and prepackaged screws to fix them to the door. Place the narrow side panel underneath the hinge side of the door and ensure the two pieces are even with one another. Check that the slot side of the narrow side panel is closest to you, as the hinges will attach to the side of the narrow side panel without the slot. As demonstrated, you can use a separator roughly the thickness of two credit cards to ensure a slight gap between the two pieces. Set the hinges so they are flush with the narrow side panel then fix the hinges to the panel using a drill and prepackaged screws. When complete, remove any separators you used and check that the hinges are even by folding the narrow side panel upwards. Insert four of the shelf pegs into the narrow side panel's pre-drilled peg holes. Gently tap these into place with a hammer. Now set the combined door and narrow side panel aside. Lay the wide side panel in front of you on your workstation. The pre-drilled holes will face up and the side with the slot will be closest to your body. Place either the top or bottom into the pre-drilled holes on one end of the side panel. Take the backing and slide it into place using the available slots on the side panel and the top or bottom just placed. Secure the panels together with the nail gun as shown or use a drill and drywall screws. Use the pre-drilled holes to fix the remaining top or bottom at the opposite end of the wide side panel and ensure its slot aligns flush with the backing. Secure as you did in the last step. Place the remaining four shelf pegs into the pre-drilled holes on this side panel and use a hammer to gently secure in place. Combine the previously constructed door and narrow side panel with the backing and wide side panel by placing the narrow side panel slot side down on top of the backing. The top and bottom pegs should slide into place on the narrow side panel and the attached door should swing down flush with the rest of the assembled cabinet. Press into place and use a rubber mallet to gently tap where the two cabinet sections join. Working from the one top corner of the narrow side panel down and around, use a nail gun or drill and drywall screws to fix the narrow side panel to the top, bottom, and backing. You should finish at the opposite top corner of the narrow side panel. Turn the cabinet so the door faces away and out from you and opens down towards your workstation with the wide side panel facing up. As in the last step, work from one top corner of the wide side panel down and around to fix the side to the top, bottom, and backing. Finally, turn the cabinet on end facing away from you with the door open. Take two shelves and angle them into the cabinet, resting them on the available shelf pegs. Congratulations! Your Innovation Cabinetry Wall End Angle Cabinet is ready to install. 